New video from Robbie09? My response to Nerdperior? Robbie09, I told you, man. I told you what would happen if you made a response video. Alright, guys, this, this can of tomatoes, it's Robbie09. <laughs> Holy shit, it's leaking. I had to do it that way because nobody was home for me to do it with my back. What's going on, guys? So, Robbie09 did respond to my video, something I told him not to do and that there would be severe consequences. Right now, I'm in the process of finding where he lives. Now, let's see what his curry-looking ass, bean and rice-having-looking penis has to say. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, I've been mixed in a little bit of drama this week. There's been some tea going around. Here's the motherfucking tea. Listen to you little fucking bitch. I actually hate women. <laughs> that wasn't funny, bro. I have a condition where I hate women. That's not funny. Basically, this guy called Nerperior decided to make an exposed video on me or something like that. I mean, it was probably the most pathetic attempt at an exposed video I have ever seen. There has been a lot of false information going around and I'm here to debunk all of the stupid points this kid made. Um, my points were all 100% verified true. And not only that, something I actually forgot to mention in the original video is that I'm starting to think Robbie09 is actually mailbox. Now, I don't really have any hard solid evidence on this, but I'm just saying Saying when I started talking to Robbie09, I'm like, holy crap, he sounded like my old friend Mailbox, and I don't have any way to prove it, but that was like the only point I, I don't have that I'm able to prove. He's always talking about how Billie Eilish is his wife. His even his old Instagram name was future husband of Billie Eilish. But how could Billie Eilish be his wife if his Instagram account name was future husband of Billie Eilish? What sense does that make? It makes perfect sense. No, it doesn't, you retard. If it's future husband of Billie Eilish, that means it is not current. You're not the husband. Before we got married, my name was future husband of Billie Eilish. Then we got married, so I changed my name to Robbie09. Come on, Gage. You gotta fix that small brain of yours. I want you all to take note that he does not include any dates in his proof. So basically, it's invalid. You say that it's invalid for me, bro? Bro, where's the marriage papers, huh? Where's the, where's the, the where's the marriage papers, curry boy? Where's the proof? Again, evidence of a small brain. Also, I don't think Nerperior should be calling me a simp when he himself is a simp. This man has simped over three girls in the past year. He's simping for Ariana Grande. He was simping for Millie Bobby Brown. And lastly, he was simping from that girl, I don't know, her name was Love or something from that Netflix show You, okay? All right, all right, bro. Um, <laughs> okay, okay, I did simp Millie Bobby Brown. But the thing is, I thought she was my age. I immediately stopped. I don't even know why. Why you had to bring that up bro first of all i didn't even simp her because the word simp didn't even exist so not only is gage a simp he's also unloyal at least i'm simping for one girl this guy's jumping from girl to girl all right it's horrible issue he was talking about how his wife has a boyfriend and how it's a good thing now i'm not gonna lie i can admit that a lot of the points he brings up in the video it's pretty accurate yeah they were pretty accurate it's true it doesn't change the fact that he's a cuck okay that video was a joke but i guess your brain is so small that it can't understand the fact that this video is indeed a joke i think you all can see that there is a very common theme in this video it's that nerperior has a small brain with a even smaller penis hit me up ladies this exposed video he made on me kind of backfired because it just exposed how small his brain is and also how small his penis is oh shit he actually he actually mentioned it 
Now, a few weeks ago on Rapio 9s channel, he made this video called 2016 YouTubers are coming back. But the thing is, an hour earlier, Optimus posted the same video with the relatively same name. Now, that's pretty crazy. Now, I can respect the hustle that Rapio 9 you know, recorded and edited the same video within an hour and then uploaded it and, you know, made a thumbnail and everything, but he's still copying another YouTuber. Okay, let's break this down. So you're saying that I wrote the script. Let's say maybe it took me 10 minutes somehow. Yes, I mean, it is possible that you wrote the script in 10 minutes. Have you seen your video? Half the video is um and all right. All right. I recorded the audio. Let's just say somehow I recorded the audio all in one take. Okay. So like what? Like four minutes and like 30 seconds, however long the video is. I got gameplay where I got to round 16 on the giant with snipers only. Bro! Every time we're on Snapchat, you're like, I'm recording gameplay right now. I, I see you on Steam all the time playing zombies. I know you record literally every time you do something. It's not that out of the way that you have 3 million hours of footage stock. Let's say somehow I did that in 25 minutes. Now I have to import the media into the editing software. Let's say five minutes. Okay. I edit the video. Let's say I somehow do it in 40 minutes. I render the video somehow, maybe eight minutes. I don't know. And lastly, I upload it to YouTube. 10 minutes. I'm sorry. I, I did. I didn't assume that you had a uh, shit PC. I'm sorry that I can render a 10 minute video in 1080p, 60 FPS, 24 million bit rate within 10 minutes. Sorry. Your videos are literally four minutes long. Again, you're showing us how small your brain is because me making a video in one hour is literally impossible. There's no way I could fit all of this. I can make a Rabio 9 video in one hour. No joke. I will make a video of me making a video in one hour. It's around 102 minutes. One hour is 60 minutes. I can't fit 102 minutes of, you know, work into 60 minutes. What do you mean? There's 100 minutes in an hour. How can you? It's just two minutes more. Now, if you haven't watched Rabio 9, if you watch his video, you know, they're typically four to five minutes long. But if you break it down, 30 seconds of that video is him just saying, uh. All right, 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 all right. <laughs> that was that was that was perfect. okay cabal that i gotta say that was the best edit i've ever seen you do on your youtube channel that was that was incredible that was incredible i won't lie i uh i kind of do do this all right a lot um thanks for the constructive criticism though you know i uh i will try harder to avoid those in the future so um thank you we are always running for the other day, I was re-downloading BO3, and I came past his Steam profile. Now, this may seem like a regular picture and all, but look at the achievement that he just got. He got the achievement called Taking Flight, and it's where you ride the dragon in Garad Krovi. But the thing is, he's had Garad Krovi for over a year, and he just got that achievement. So he must suck at COD Zombies if he can't even pack a punch in Garad Krovi. Okay, that's because I never play Garad Krovi on on PC. What do you mean? We you bought you bought the DLC two after two days after I bought mine and we played together. I used to play a lot of Garage Krovi on my PS4 where I would pack a punch a lot. Oh yeah, give us proof of you pack a punching on PS4 then, Ravio9. Where's your proof? Oh, and by the way, my highest round in zombies is round 101. Much higher than yours. Okay, where's the proof? Where's Mr. Panzer? Fuck, never mind. He has proof. Next up, Rabio9 hates minorities. Okay, okay. I I guess he kind of got me there. <laughs> Okay, now I'm gonna rant for a little bit. So, when Nerdperior made this video on me, right, this whole exposed thing, you see, a lot of people, basically everyone was on his side, and Gage was using horrible evidence with no dates, it wasn't any kind of concrete evidence. You don't even have the, the marriage, the marriage papers in your video. How are you, you didn't even prove that Billie Eilish is your wife. It was just random clips he was using and some random stuff he was saying that means nothing. His proof is invalid, and everyone took his side. I didn't have proof. 
true for you hating minorities, but you still hate them. We had people making tweets about me. We had people making videos about me. <laughs> Wait, I didn't I didn't even know people actually made a video about him. And siding with Nerd Perrier, even though he's clearly wrong. Also, something else I wanted to add, that little pathetic diss track he made, when he said that Billie Eilish is a hoe, I, I was so mad. He is also greedy, okay? He loves money, and he only does YouTube for the money. From this tweet here, you can show him flexing, showing off his money, thinking that he's better than everybody. You can show <laughs> Fuck my fans, okay? I did YouTube for the money, guys. What are you gonna do about it, huh? Yeah, Ravio9, you exposed the fact that I do m YouTube for money. I'm pretty sure everybody knows it at this point, guys. I'm balling out $1.28 in the last 28 days. Okay, no, Nurperior, done. You're canceled after this video. I just exposed you, all right? You don't care about your fans. You only care about the money. That's all you ever cared about, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm on to you. I'm on to you now. Oh, yeah. I. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and anyways, thank you everyone for watching this video. Um, it's a joke. Yeah, see you next week. 85 subscribers. I love you all. Thank you. Yeah, new video next week. All right, guys, I gotta admit this. Ravio9 really outdid me. I, I just made a video, um, kind of just going off a list of stuff I wrote down for like over a month. I actually planned that video out around the beginning of May when the whole H3H3 stuff started. And I wrote down ideas every day. And then that video that I did was just a whole improvisation, uh, improvising thing where I went off each of them and I just improvised. And it did turn out really bad, but Ravio9's video did turn out not amazing guys you definitely need to go check out his video it's so funny that was one of the best videos i ever watched definitely the best video on his channel just because you know it, it's me in it um yeah guys i love you all i mean i love money sorry <laughs> my bad but anyways guys i love you all thank you so much for watching this this, this video and peace But I do want to say fuck you, Robbie09. We're not friends anymore. <laughs>